to the wealthy place and you are welcome to 2018 it is a privilege to be alive to see this beautiful year and i believe you have so many goals ambitions and resolutions you've made to make this year the best year so far and that's why i've decided to share with you from a book titled no excuses by brian tracy this book is sure to inspire anyone who hungers to do more anyone who desires to achieve more in this year and in life generally join me as we enjoy the book now there are a thousand excuses for failure but there is never a good reason the author encourages us to be disciplined in order to achieve our goals in this year 2018 self-discipline is the high road to success self-discipline is doing what you should do when you should do it whether you feel like it or not the link and the bridge between your goals and accomplishments is discipline discipline is the bridge the middleman between your goals and your accomplishments willingness is another requirement for succeeding now occasionally some people might be willing to pay part of the price but for you to succeed you need to pay the whole price for success you need to know what the whole price is and then you need to be able to pay the whole price for success another requirement for succeeding is learning from experts learning from those who are excelling and succeeding in the path or the area you choose to tread in this new year you need to learn from the experts now there are seven major points for achieving your goals in this year according to brian tracy in his book no excuses number one decide exactly what you want you need to know exactly what you want in this year 2018 you need to be specific this is not a rehearsal the year has already started you need to know what exactly you want and then you need to write it down that is the second point writing down what you want number one decide exactly what you want number two write it down when you write down your goals it gives you the ability to concentrate on exactly what it is you hope to achieve the number three point is to set a deadline for your goals you need to be time bound and be specific when do you hope to achieve the goals set a deadline the fourth thing is to think of all the possible things that could help you achieve or not achieve your goals think of your strengths your weaknesses your opportunities and your threats think of the people the skills the talents and everything you need that's the fourth point now the fifth point for achieving your goals in this year 2018 is to arrange your goals in sequence in priority in order how urgent how important are the goals you hope to achieve in this year the sixth thing is to take action immediately do not procrastinate take action now and the seventh thing you need to do in order to achieve your goals in this year is to do something every day that moves you closer to achieving your goals these are the seven points for achieving success and achieving your goals in 2018 and dear listener are your goals so big they scare you you don't know how to achieve it just take courage now courage is not the absence of fear courage is the mastery and control of fear when you feel scared or afraid of pushing and moving towards achieving your dreams do the opposite instead tell yourself i can do it despite the odds no matter the odds i can do it so like me my goals are so big they could scare me at times but the author encourages us to be courageous and the author tells us that we should persevere we should be strong because the difference between winners and losers in life is very simple winners never quit and quitters never win be optimistic believe in yourself 2018 is your year Thank you for staying with me today, even as we reviewed the book, No Excuses. Join me for another edition as we go into the part two of the book. And I'm sure you are going to excel in this year, 2018. I remain your friend, Glory. I would love you to comment in the comment section below, like this video, and subscribe to my channel. Till another time, this is your year. You need to move. Thank you. Say praise the Lord. And when I found that he had done too much, oh.